Hi folks, Max from Galaxy Note 3, root.com. Um, I've got some great news. Uh, if you want to install non-team mobile ROMs, uh, or if you want to install GTN, uh, sorry, SMN9005, the international LT models, um, on your T-Mobile, or if you have a Canadian um, Galaxy Note 3, I've got, um, uh, what is this ROM called? Oh, Bobcat ROM, one of my favorite ROMs installed here. Um, with Android 4.3, you could install this uh, patch that could uh, fix it. Now, with Android 4.4.2 KitKat, um, that patch doesn't work. And uh, basically, you're, you know, I've installed it. It's running fine. Just my Wi-Fi doesn't work. Uh, NFC doesn't work. Um, it took me like I got up like super early today, but I figured it out. I made a zip file um, that will make it work. Now first, um, to install KitKat ROMs for another ROM, you first have to do have a KitKat bootloader. Um, so make sure you have a KitKat bootloader. Um, that's the only requirement. Um, now you should be able to install all the TouchWiz KitKat ROMs uh, from G uh, SMN9005 to your T-Mobile, a Canadian. Also should work with other variants, um, any LT Note 3 variants. Um, so let's go ahead and do this. Go ahead and download the patch file which I made, which I just made, and then go ahead and go to recovery. Uh, after you install the ROM you want to install, the G, uh, SMN9005 ROM, any ROM um, that's KitKat. Um, I also do have a patch you can use. Um, it's on my site. I'll have links to it on my site. Check it out. Uh, but basically, install the ROM. Make sure it boots. Um, install this Wi-Fi and NFC fix. I simply um, actually, it took me a while. I took out some of the stuff that wasn't needed uh, and then put this together. Um, just go to uh, install zip and then go ahead and find the file. The file is going to be called uh, Wi Fi Fix N900TV2. I just made it. Um, this is going to be great because now you should, you know, instead of just installing T Mobile ROMs or Canadian ROMs, um, you're going to be able to install. Um, all the all the new KitKat ROMs on your T-Mobile or Canadian uh, Note 3. So good stuff. Um, and what happened was I actually gave my SMN9005 uh, uh, phone to one of my best friends who was here from Philippines and then kind of regretting it right now because I need to do ROM reviews. That's why I was working on this because I need to do the ROM reviews, and if the Wi-Fi and NFC doesn't work, I can still kind of wing it. But it's better if I can make it work completely on the T-Mobile device. Um, that way, also, you know, T-Mobile and Canadian users can install the GTN uh, SM and 9005 ROMs. Now, the other way, you can actually install T-Mobile or Canadian ROMs on the SM and 9005 just fine without doing any of this. Uh, but now you see with the patch. Wi-Fi works, you'll see Wi-Fi works, and NFC, uh, oh, you know what, one more step I forgot to add, um, you do have to install Compulsion Kernel, a T-Mobile kernel, that will complete it, because um, when I first tested it, I installed Compulsion Kernel, Compulsion Kernel, and then installed a patch, I'm not sure if the kernel was part of it, but now it makes sense kernel you you do also have to install the kernel um, to get the NFC working so go ahead and uh, go ahead and download the com the latest version of compulsion kernel which I already downloaded here uh, compulsion kernel this one also works on Canadian uh, note 3 so you can use it uh, for T-Mobile Canadian or even um, SMN9005 all right I don't know why Samsung made it like that it's like uh, all the T-Mobile stuff are, you know, compatible on the international SMN9005, but the opposite, oh, it's not working, so that's why we need these stupid patches. And uh, Anyway, hopefully this will work. I'm just recording this video just in case everything works out. Um, so basically, you need the patch and the kernel, a T-Mobile kernel, um, to run on T-Mobile or a Canadian. By the way, T-Mobile and Canadian um, Note 3s are pretty much identical, um, just the way they work. All right, so we've got Wi-Fi working. 
uh, Bluetooth working, NFC working, boom shakalaka. There we go. So we got everything working, no errors. I was getting a bunch of um, errors. So uh, have fun, guys. I just want to post this out there because uh, now I figured out finally how to get uh, Bobcat ROM running, which is one of my favorite ROMs on my team, Mobile Note 3. Awesome stuff. Uh, anyway, I'll see you guys soon. Uh, as always, stay high on Android. Yeah.